So here at the LA Auto Show, we're Brendan Meyer, uh, head of uh, Porsche North America. Yes. Uh, even though we're here in LA, you had uh, news back in Atlanta this yeah, we, week, right? Yeah, we had a big event yesterday. Um, basically, one vision we had two or three years ago became reality when we had the groundbreaking of our new headquarters for Porsche in the United States. So a new home, but uh, with a nice, big and fun backyard. <laughs> it would be kind of unique because we wanted not only to integrate all our employees from, from our different affi affiliates here in the United States. We have uh, Porsche Financial Services in Chicago. We want yeah. we bring them to, to Atlanta. But this will be, a, I think, a unique place where we can experience the brand in all the, with all the facets and all the values. So we will have a museum. We will have uh, a classical car restoration center. We will have a business center. We will have... Uh, Uh, driving simulators, and most importantly, we will have right at this building a brand new test track. Yeah, that was I referring as the backyard, <laughs> the, play, the place to play. Brand new test track. And the amazing thing is, we are just two minutes from the terminals of the biggest airport in the world. That's Atlanta. amazing. So very neat. So this will, this will be a center like in Germany where people can go and I mean, here in the U.S. there's not a culture of ordering a car. But can people buy a Porsche and then go test drive it there in Atlanta and then go drive home? Absolutely. They would uh, be able to uh, go to their own dealers, buy a car, and say, I want this car to be delivered at this uh, Porsche driving oh, okay. center in Atlanta. They could come to our, uh, our center, then uh, have a few uh, a good visit of our museum cars and uh, all our facilities and have a, a driving session with our instru instructors. Kind of unique concept in the United States. Yeah, and, uh, and this I, is what we are doing, in, in fact, in Germany already, yeah. where a lot of people can uh, order their cars and go to the factory and uh, pick up the car directly at the factory driving in Europe. So we are off also offering this for our U.S. customers. Yeah, and bring it closer to home. And you have a fantastic lineup nowadays. Uh, since the addition of the Cayenne, and now you have like more and more cars, you have the Cayman, Uh, the Boxer, so a lot of nice things to try in that test drive. Absolutely, track. we have been on fire this year, I tell yeah. you. I mean, we have just launched a new generation, the seventh generation of the new 911, beginning of this year. Then we came with a new Boxer generation. Um, we had some different um, derivatives coming up, like the Cayenne Diesel in September. And now we are revealing for the first time in the world uh, our new Cam Cayman. Uh, which is in the Boxer family, a uh, very nice car in short, um, it has become much lighter, we saved about 60 pounds, it has more performance and uh, of course very very important in the nowadays it's very fuel efficient. We have, yeah. we have been able to make a more performing cars, saving 15% of fuel, fuel consumption, making this a car achieving an average 32 miles per gallon on a highway, which is pretty good for this yeah, type of stuff. Yeah, the car. engineering of Porsche is always like it's the envy of all the auto industry because you have the small engine with a lot of power and like amazing driving ability that's in the car. Exactly, that's what we call uh, intelligent performance. Not yeah. making the biggest car, not making the most yeah. biggest engine, but having a very neat concept where light weight comes as important as the performance of the engine. Esto es Autos 060 y como les digo siempre, no quiten la vista de la carretera y mantengan los oídos en Autos 060. Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting.